Welcome back to Harris Cherokee Casino Field and the Infinite Energy Arena. Mark Zeno alongside Drew Petkoff. Final here this afternoon, Georgia Swarm 13, the Saskatchewan Rush 10. Drew, an exciting matchup between the last two NLL champions, and it didn't disappoint. No, and the Swarm came off to a really hot start. They scored six goals early, I believe it was, five goals early, chased Evan Kirk from the net, and from there, the game did slow down just a little bit, but they really set themselves up for success. Well, as we take a look at the highlights from this game, plenty of scoring early on from the Georgia Swarm, as you mentioned, getting the best of Evan Kirk. Yeah, and we see a great pick and roll play. It's really a great sign to start your game off with one of those types of plays because it's, it shows that everybody's on the same page and everybody is working together to score one of those goals. Despite the fact the Swarm got out to an early lead, the Saskatchewan rush kept coming. You saw them paced by Matthew Dinsdale, Mark Matthews with three goals of his own, and it was kind of expected at that point. Yeah, the, the rush took a while to really warm up, but once they did, they really scored some unbelievable goals as well, having contributions from a lot of different players over the course of the evening. Ultimately, Mike Pullen was very good between the pipes this afternoon, stopping a lot of the shots that came his way against a very talented Saskatchewan team. Yeah, Mike Pullen was great, as he's always been throughout this year. Uh, the Swarm defense in general had an unbelievable game. They really stepped up to the plate, causing a lot of forced turnovers early and really causing the, the rush, excuse me, to, to be offbeat in terms of their offensive production. And that goal by Connor Sellers was the final 13 goals for the Georgia Swarm as they win 13 to 10. For Drew Petkoff, I'm Mark Zinno. You've been watching the National Lacrosse League on BR Live.